<clears throat> all right, Shalom. Shalom. All right, first and foremost, we want to give our praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakakwadash. All right, give double honors to the elders, apostles at GMS, and salutations and blessings to the Akim around the world, preaching and teaching his truth. All right, we the GMS Memphis Count, I'm Yakanan. Yanar Allah. Okay, and uh, today we got a lesson just going into uh, laboring to uh, receive our glory, you know. And, um, you know, that's that's what we have to do in this truth, man. We got to labor, you know, uh, uh, in order to receive that glory, man. We got to go through uh, uh, hardships. We got to work, you know. And um, on the other end of, uh, of that hard work is a reward, man, okay? And that reward is going to be the kingdom of heaven, everlasting life, you know, eternal glory. You know, all those things are going to come. But we have to uh, fight, man. We have to work in this truth in order to get there, man. We we, we have to, uh, uh, you know, matter of fact, we're going to get the word for uh, labor, you know, and uh, get some scriptures and Lord willing this be edifying for the elect. <clears throat> word labor in ethemonline.com. This is the verb and it means to perform manual or physical work. Work hard. Yep. Keep busy. Take pains. Strive, endeavor. Mm -hmm. uh, strive. Hey, strive. What does the scripture say? Strive for the truth unto death, man. Right. You got to labor in this thing unto death, man, if need be. Mm -hmm. You know, keep going. From Latin, to work, endeavor, take pain, exert oneself, produce by toll, suffer. Suffer. Mm -hmm. Keep going. Be afflicted. Yep. Be in distress or difficulty. See? Yep, hey, and that's that's all things that we're gonna go through in this truth, man. Laboring in this truth. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, uh, scriptures say the <clears throat> the servant is not greater than his master. Yeah, how was shot? Look at look at the example he left, man. Look at what he had to go through on uh, it in, in order to get that honor, mm -hmm. you know, to get that uh, ultimate glory. You know, he had to labor. You know, he hey, what what did he say? Uh, uh, I've come to uh, do my father's business. Yep, yep. You know, he came and got right to work, man. From from twelve years old until until his uh, day he died, man. Mm -hmm. He he gave up the spirit. He went to work, man. And we gotta we gotta be in that same mindset, man. Okay. You know, you okay. got it. Okay. it. Just a little bit more on the okay. definition. Okay. It say like the verb in modern French, Spanish, and Portuguese means to plow. Uh huh. Ooh, the yeah. plow. Yeah. The plow, man. Mm -hmm. Hey, we, we we gotta we gotta plow. You gotta work. You gotta labor. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah, hey, all those things, man, are, 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 are part of your uh your journey, man. It's part of what the Lord put in you to do. Mm -hmm. You know, to please him and ultimately to, to receive that, that glory and receive that reward, man. Mm -hmm. You gotta have that drive in you, man, to be able to, you know, continue on and to and to do this, man. Believe this, man. Yeah. You know? Because yeah, if I may add, the scriptures say, uh, if any man take his hand from the plow, he's yep. not fit for the kingdom of heaven. Right. So you got to keep laboring. <laughs> uh-huh. That's a good, a beautiful point, bro. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Hey, because if you take your hand from the plow, you gave up, man. You quit, you quit laboring. Mm -hmm. You quit working. You know? So, like the brother said, you're not fit for the kingdom. Well, like the scriptures say. Like the scriptures say, you're not fit for the kingdom, man. So yeah, let's get let's get to the scripts. This is Hebrews chapter four and verse eleven. Let us labor, therefore, to enter into that rest, mm -hmm. lest any man fall after the same example of unbelief. See, hey, let us labor to enter into that rest, man, mm -hmm. because we're gonna get rest, man. You know, uh, that's what Jake really and truly want, man. Jake want to be uh, comfortable, man. Jake want to have that rest, man. <clears throat> but the scriptures tell you, hey, this is not our rest, man. This is not it right now, man. We got to labor to get to that rest, man. You know, this ain't the time to be uh, uh, lackadaisical and, and, you know, in that, that laid back spirit, you know. Just letting things just going with the flow. No, we got to turn up, man. This is the uh, apostle calling this the year of the turn up, man. So we got to turn up, man. 
You know, we got to be on fire for this truth, man. That's right. You know, brothers should be, you know, on fire, man. The way we seeing things play out in the earth right now, man, you supposed to be on fire, man. Amen. Hey, man, uh, we see the Lord working, man. Brothers got different testimonies, man, but we understand the Lord is working, man. He he dealing with his elect, man. He dealing with his chosen, man. Yes. You know, you got it up. Huh? This is uh First Corinthians chapter 15, starting at 57. Yep. But thanks be to the Most High, which giveth us the victory through our Lord, Yahweh Shah Hamashiach. Yep. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be ye steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. For as much as you know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. See, hey, I'll be steadfast and movable, always abounding in the work. You should always be abounding in this in this work, man. Mm -hmm. Always uh, uh, looking for a way to uh, push another video or uh, do something beneficial to the truth, mm -hmm. to this ministry, in some way, form, or fashion, whether you're helping a brother. You know, whether you're reading, you're studying, you're building yourself up, you know, whatever it may be, man, uh, 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 you know, uh, do it to the best of your ability, man. Mm -hmm. You know? <clears throat> you, well, right. This is uh, Ecclesiastes chapter 12, and starting at uh, 13. Mm -hmm. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. All right. Fear the Most High and keep His commandments. For this is the whole duty of man. Right, that's it, man. You're supposed to fear the Lord and keep his commandments. This is the whole duty of man. Mm -hmm. You know? And hey, that's 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 something that that brothers, you know, that's a that's a commandment, man. That's something brothers should already know. Is to, you know, when you come in the truth, man, hey, I gotta follow the law, statutes, and commandments, and I gotta do the work, man. Mm -hmm. You know, this is what the Lord requires of me. You know, playing around out here in the world, we don't we don't have those aspirations anymore of uh, you know, being something in this world, man, in this kingdom. Now not to say brothers bonds, man. We just out here just, you know, uh catching rides to different places, Jake ain't Jake borrowing money. We're not doing any of those things. Brothers got jobs and stuff, but we don't we don't uh uh put our our stock into that, man. We don't we you know, our our stock and our focus is in these scriptures, man, you know, and, and pushing toward the kingdom of heaven, okay, doing things that are going to be beneficial to this truth, man, okay, that's what, that's what we're, we're focused on right now, man, all right, you get it. This is uh, back in Ecclesiastes chapter 4 and verse 9, and it reads, two are better than one because they have a good reward for their labor. Yep, two is better than one. Just like uh, it's a scripture that say uh, uh, two is better than one because when the other fall, you got somebody to lift you up, mm. you know? So that's the same with this truth, man. Hey, you got you got uh, somebody with you that's in, the, in that same battle. Right. You got a brother, man, that's fighting with you. It's the, <laughs> next, it's the next verse. Oh, come on. Yeah. Hey, hey, read that again. Come, huh? come on. This is Ecclesiastes chapter four and nine. Two are better than one yep. because they have a good reward for their labor. They have a good reward for their labor because if you continue on, you ain't doing this faith, man. You're gonna receive that reward, man. Right. The Lord is gonna, uh, uh, He's gonna hold up His end of the deal, man. But you gotta do your part. Jake got to You gotta do the work, man. Mm. You gotta do the work. You gotta labor, man. Mm. That's part of it. Mm. You know, that's part of you fulfilling your. Your end of the deal, you know. <laughs> you had a precept. Yeah, yeah. Okay, a this is Philippians chapter two and twelve. It say, "Wherefore, my beloved, as ye have always obeyed, not in my presence only, but now much more in my absence, yep. work out your own salvation with fear and trembling." Mm -hmm. Yeah, going back to that labor because hey, this is what we got to do because hey, we, we know what's in store. You know what I'm saying? When our Lord and Savior come back, yeah, yep. he's going to give us our rest, but we also know he's coming back with destruction. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. hey, we got to work our own salvation with fear and trembling. That's right. You got to work it. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> right, you got to labor. <laughs> yep. 
Work out your own salvation, man. Not just sitting back waiting and saying, oh, I'm saved, I believe. You know, no, you got a hey, faith without works is dead, man. You got to do the work. You got to act on it. Right. You got it. Good. This is uh, Lamentation chapter 5 and verse 5. It reads, our necks are under persecution. Yep. We labor and have no rest. See, and we, are, we don't have any rest here, man. Man, man, me and the brother was just sitting there speaking about how, how tired we are, man. How, how vexed you are with this place, man. This, this shit is vexing, man. You do all this work, man. Jake tired, body aching. You just got to keep going, man. There ain't no rest here, man. You know, our necks are under persecution at all times, man. Esau Edo, man, he got his foot on our neck, man. You know, he in, he's in that power seat right now. And he ain't letting up, man. That's why we got to have a, a savior come back and deliver us, man. We got to get get a, a, a delivered out of this hell, man. All right? It ain't, no, ain't going to be no peace, no rest, no nothing here, man. You know? <coughs> so, so this is St. John chapter 4 and verse 38. And it reads, I sent you to reap that whereon you bestowed no labor. Mm -hmm. Other men labor and ye are entered into the labors. Yep, other men labor uh, like our elders and apostles and the men before them. Mm -hmm. Okay, they 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 started uh, that labor, man. Some of the men died in this truth, man. Right. You know, Elder Alba Bivens. Okay, uh, 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 <coughs> <coughs> priest, uh, high priest Ari, you know, uh, King Masha. All right, all those men, man, have been, you know, pushing the word years, man. Some of some of those men died in the faith, man. But hey, we're we're entering into their labors now, man. Right. We got to keep pushing, and it's gonna be men after us, man. He said, hey, you're gonna have brothers come in at the eleventh hour, okay? You got we gotta push this thing, man, into the end, man. We gotta endure in this truth, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and that that takes faith, okay? That takes prayer. And that takes a mindset of, of uh, uh, pushing, man, and laboring, mm -hmm. you know, and in order to, to ultimately receive that glory and that reward, man, from your how about Shema Shai. That's right. Okay? Um, get that word glory, too. Uh, yeah, this is good. Okay. Yeah, it's good. This is the word uh, glory in the anthem online from the 12th century, and it says, Ooh, the splendor of the Most High, or Hamashiach, yep. <laughs> praise offered to the Most High, worship. Uh, it, uh, from the Latin, it says fame, renown. See? Oh yeah, come on, man. <laughs> hey, that's what we laboring for: fame, glory, that honor. <laughs> yeah, what the show say? Say a uh, great praise or honor. See, right. Great praise or honor. So that's what you fighting for, man. You know, we're fighting for that because <coughs> ultimately that's that's all going to be received in the kingdom, man, mm -hmm. you know, but we have to labor to get there. You have some men, they striving for that right now on this side, man. They want to receive glory now. They want to get that praise of men now, but we don't give a damn about that, man. Mm -hmm. Okay. We, we're trying to uh, uh, receive that ultimate prize, that ultimate goal. You know, the ultimate glory from your how about Shema Al Shah, man. Get those uh, uh, crowns put on our heads, man. Like it goes into in, uh, what is that, second entrance, man. Uh, yeah, you know? Yeah. That's yeah. part of that glory, man. And those are, uh, uh, you know, that's reserved for the Lord's elect, man. You know, you can get the next one. God. This is uh, in St. Matthew chapter um, 19, starting in 27. And it reads, then answered Peter, at 29 and 27, <clears throat> then answered Peter and said unto, it's like it. this is Matthew 19 and 27, then answered Peter and said unto him, behold, we have forsaken all and followed thee. Right. What shall we have there for? And Yahweh said unto them, verily I say unto you, that ye which have followed me in the regeneration where the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, ye also shall sit upon the twelve thrones 
judges the twelve tribes of Israel. Yep. And everyone that has forsaken house or brethren or sister mm -hmm. or father or mother or wife or children or lands for my name's sake shall receive an hundredfold and shall inherit everlasting life. Right. But many that are first shall be last and the last shall be first. <clears throat> That's it, man. Hey, and that that we we giving up everything, man. You got brothers, man, that hey have lost it all, man. Mm -hmm. But it's all for that 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 uh, ultimate goal, man. That glory, man, which is gonna come in the kingdom of heaven, man. Right. Okay, and how Shai is gonna bless us with everything, man. We're gonna be joint heirs in the kingdom with him, man. Mm -hmm. You know, the Lord gave him everything, and if you joint heirs with him, you're gonna receive it all, man. You're mm -hmm. gonna receive everything. So it's worth giving up this 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 uh life that is re we we're really not living anyway, man. Yeah. What the hell are you really giving up, man? You ain't lo you what are you doing? You ain't living. Mm -hmm. You are you you're under the devil. You know, you're under the so-called white man. You don't own anything, you know? You're just catching hell, man. Here you are, man, right now, man, probably uh Jake either uh working. Or at home, you know, getting ready to, uh, you know, lay it down and get ready to go to work, man. You know what I'm saying? That's all it is. It's slavery, man. A continual cycle, man. A hamster on the wheel. Going nowhere fast, man. You know? And time is speeding up, too, man. We see it, man. We and the bro just looking at, yeah, damn, it's this late. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Damn. Hey, it's almost over, man. We not, we man, <laughs> brothers, we, we, we're not living, man. You know, and and what we're doing now, man. This is this is the real work, man. This is a a, a most important job we have, man. You know, fighting fighting to enter into that rest, man. To enter into a, a everlasting life, man, and get that glory, man. <laughs> man, this is this is worth this is worth fighting for, man. This is worth dying for, man. You know, whatever happens, man, it's worth it, man. If we can just endure. You know, hey, hey, if we are the elect, man. Hey, scripture say we were bought with a price. You know, Yahweh Shai, uh, 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 you know, he, 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 he paid for us in his blood, man. Right. Come on, man. <laughs> we got, we got to fight, man, brothers. We got to work. We got to labor. We got to endure in this thing, man. You know, you got to have that mindset of, of getting a victory, man. Overcoming. You know, because if we're the elect, we're going to overcome, man. No matter what, we can't lose, man. You know? <laughs> hey, like the scripture, uh, what is that, in, in Romans, man, say who will separate them from the uh, love of Hamashiach. Yeah, oh, yeah, no principalities. No yeah, no principalities, <laughs> no death, no yeah. nothing, man. Nothing yeah. can separate us, man. We're going we gonna, to we gonna get the victory, man, you know. Because hey, we are that that chosen, Lord willing, man. We we are part of that number, man. Damn. You know, so we can get that last one. Come, come. Okay, uh, is, uh, you had some. Yeah, just oh, okay. One. You got it. This is Revelations chapter three and eleven. Behold, I come quickly. Yep. Hold that fast which thou hast, that on, no man. man take thy crown. Oh, man, you want to speak on it? Yep. That's like what the brothers are going into, man. We gotta hold fast and keep fighting. Yep. And it's true, you know what I'm saying? Cause we know we 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 already know what's expected mm -hmm. to come. You know what I'm saying? Especially the glory that's what that we're going into, laboring for the glory yep. of the kingdom of heaven that's to come, man. Hey, we gotta hold fast. Mm -hmm. Like like the preacher was saying, that no man take our crown, cause that crown, you know what I'm saying, going into immortality, that life, yep. that eternal rest that we're gonna receive from the heavenly father and his and his son. Mm -hmm. uh. Yep, that's it, man. That's it, so, man, you gotta, you gotta fight. You gotta do whatever you can to hold on to that, man. This, this, this life right here, life. You, re you really holding on to life. Are you gonna <laughs> let that go and go to death, man? That don't make sense. No, mm -hmm. we gonna hold on to that, man. Right. <laughs> we gonna hold on to that, man. You got it. So this is uh, Hebrews chapter six in uh, verse ten, and it reads, "For the Most High is not unrighteous to forget your work or and labor of love which ye have showed toward His name, mm -hmm. 
It's Nick. Ooh. Wait, read that again, bro. Ooh, this, is, this is Hebrews chapter 6 and 10. For the Most High is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love, which he have showed toward his name, mm. and that ye have ministered to the saints and do minister. Yup, hey man, that said it all right there, man, <laughs> to his name. So that let you know, hey, you got to have a name, man, you know, and the Lord is not going to forget those men who call upon him, man, you know, who's crying out to him, man, who's laboring for him, man, who's fighting for him, you know, he going to come back, man, and, 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 and you know, he going to deliver those men, you know, he's going to exalt those men, you know. Man, <laughs> hey, Lord willing, we'll part that number, man. Read that one more time, bro. That was a beautiful script, man. Uh, this is Hebrews chapter 6 and verse 10. Yep. For the Most High is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love. Right. The Lord is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love, man. What we doing is not going unnoticed, man. Hey, the angels are recording this, man. Even if we ain't getting views, people not really watching, the angels see it, man. The Lord see it. They report, oh, yeah, they still, they doing their work, Lord. They sincere. They, they pushing, you know. <laughs> he, 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 hey, he smiling upon that. Hey, just keep going. Keep going, man. Don't give up. Keep fighting. We close. You got it. Uh, this is Hebrews 6 and 10. For the... For the Most High is not unrighteous to forget the <clears throat> work and labor of love which he have showed toward his name and that ye have ministered to the saints and do minister. And do minister, man. So we got to continue on, man. We got to keep doing it, doing this, man. Keep pushing this truth, man. Keep fighting. Keep believing, man. Keep laboring for that glory, man. You know? So, hey, with that, Lord willing, this was an edifying lesson for the elect. Once again, we want to give our praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Akapodash. Give double honors to the elders, <coughs> apostles, and GMS. Salutations and blessings to the elect. Shalom. Shalom. <coughs>